What's going on everybody? Welcome back. My name is Adrian and today I'm going to be playing a game called North Prey Massacre. So already it's got that nice VHS glitchy style that I like. Let's play this. Oh, I see. There's three different things. Okay. Intro. Let's start with 1990 intro. Here I am driving a car. Continue driving. Play tape. This is a pre-recorded instruction for police officers. You are about to join a search party. The goal is to track down the person behind the three homicides that happened at the Route 89 Motel. Police officers have permission to use firearms if necessary. Okay. The North Prey Forest is under lockdown. Civilians must be escorted back to the city. Three teams are responsible for the track down of the suspect. The motel team is working around the Route 89 Motel. Investigators are already analyzing the area of the motel. The most recent homicide happened at 1990 February 2nd. The South and West team are working around the North Bay Forest. Progression is slow due to the size of the area. If the search party couldn't find any liable evidence or any member of the search party gets injured or disappear, the search party will be shut down. Okay. Well, I'm reading this note here that says, Tell Daniel that a guy came in today and said that there is a small cabin on the west side of the forest where a person still lives. Heard some noises around there. Tear that place apart, come back with something useful. Easier said than done. What about you? Uh, Police Department of North Bray. Oh, don't mind me, guys. I'm just going to read this while I'm driving and not pay attention to the road at all, apparently. Name unknown, age unknown, weight unknown, height 65 to 69. Jesus. The Police Department of North Bray closes down the North Bray Forest for safety precautions. A search party has been organized to track down the disappeared officer. Only PDN officers or search party members can enter the forest. Details! The information written down is from eyewitnesses. The PDN never encountered the suspect. Uh, the suspect has been active in the area of the North Bay Forest and the Route 89 Motel. The photograph showed above was taken by a witness at the motel. The suspect has shown highly aggressive behavior. Its face is usually covered with a pig mask. Different kinds as eyewitnesses reported. The suspect's weapons are a kitchen knife and a fire axe, usually wears a shirt and a black apron. One eyewitness saw the suspect with a bulletproof vest. The suspect has been seen trying to open motel doors and staring into the windows of the motel. Three homicides are connected with the suspect. The PDN must use firearms to take down the suspect if it's not cooperative with officers. Warning! If a civilian encounters a person with the correct, correct description mentioned above, flee the area, contact the PDN immediately okay continue driving yes this will exit the scene yes and it crashed oh and here i am oh my god door is locked <laughs> yeah of course where am i i seem to be trapped in a basement held against my will even is there like a key dude can i oh why would you leave a key in the room with a locked victim in there? Okay. Already, I'm kind of getting Northberry Grove vibes. And I don't know if that's partially because the name of this game is similar, just white noise. Oh, there's a puzzle here. Okay. Well, I'm clearly not going to be able to figure that out quite yet. So let me just continue onward. There's also, uh, this door is locked. Let's squeeze in here. There's also an assailant that seems to favor having a mask of an animal on his face. Oh, dude, why? Well, you and your big old butt can just stand there in the corner. I don't care. I hid his key under my bed. I don't know what it opens. Okay. Um, is there a way to crouch and find it? Oh, there we go. There's the key. I picked up a key. All right, dude. Um. You have a good time standing there facing the wall. Squeeze out. What's going to happen now? Oh, I'm nervous. I feel like I'm going to be attacked. Oh, well. Let's keep going. Am I going to be attacked? Police report. Reporting officer Daniel Ross, victim Elizabeth Way. Uh, the police department of North Prey received a call from a guest at Route 89 Motel that a person was murdered. Three police officers were sent out to investigate the homicide and arrived at the scene at... 3.30 a.m. The victim, Elizabeth Way, was found with six stab wounds in the chest. Suspects of the homicide saw a man running into the nearby forest. 
Police officer redacted went to investigate the forest and went missing. A search party will be organized if officer redacted doesn't show up after 12 hours of his disappearance. Daniel Ross. Okay, is that all that was in here? Is there nothing else useful? Wait, 3.30 a.m. That must be what I have to input into the clock. So let's go wind that clock up to 3.30 a.m. Wind it, wind it, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. There, 3.30. Okay. I think it worked. I can't interact with the clock anymore, so. That definitely worked. I don't know what it did, though. Oh. This is a new path. Okay. Gonna keep it moving again. Okay, I thought I. S oh, what? What am I looking at here? What is going on in this in this room? Why is there a suit of armor sitting there? It makes no sense. All right, well, I guess I gotta use this arcade machine. Info. Escort the brave knight through a dangerous maze. Use W to move forward, S to move backward, and AD to rotate him around. Hold the right mouse button to bring light to the dark and mysterious maze. X to close, okay. Oh, I see. I don't know what's going on here, but I'm here. Oh, shoot. This is not gonna go well, I can already tell. What? What was that noise? Oh. What is this? What am I looking at here? Oh, a key! Alright, I got the key. Well, this is intriguing. Wasn't expecting this. Wait, is this a different way? No, that's where I found the key. So do I have to bring it back to where I was? Or do I have to actually escape this maze? Can I take the key now? Yes! Oh, that's dope! That's cool! That's an interesting little mechanic, okay. I like that! That's cool! So what door do I use this on, though? That's my only question. Why is it so dark, also? There doesn't seem to be any... any other way out. Can I unlock you? No. So what do I do? Was I not supposed to do that? I don't understand. Oh, basement door. I didn't even see that. Okay, well, I'm out of here, I guess. I think. Okay, maybe not. Door is locked. Wonderful. Okay. Thank you. Oh. Did I miss something? Well... That was the intro, um... Oh. This was the thing. Yeah, this was the... This was the thing. Okay. Um, was there some kind of assailant? I think I missed. Yeah, I'm gonna guess that that was it. That was the game. I do like that it has some puzzle aspects to it, and it definitely provided some interesting gameplay mechanics that I don't really feel like I've seen too many times in other indie games. But the ending was a little abrupt. I don't know if I missed something, if I was facing the wrong way or something. I, I don't know. I was expecting to be at least like chased by the assailant, whatever you want to call him. But this is just a demo after all, so I'm assuming there's going to be more added to this and there's going to be a little bit more depth. But this is a really good start, I gotta say. I mean, it definitely provides the perfect atmosphere for this kind of game. And the whole VHS overlay effect is spot on. I love stuff like that. So overall, I enjoyed playing this. And if you guys want to try this game out for yourselves, I'll leave a link down below in the description for you. But that's going to do it for me here today. Thanks everyone so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button down below if you did. And don't be afraid to leave me a comment as well. And if you like what I'm doing on this channel and you want to catch a new video every single day of the week, I would love it if you hit that subscribe button for me. Try to hit my goal of a thousand subscribers before the year ends. And I would love your help in doing that. Thanks again for watching everyone. And I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Take it easy.